welcome back. Today I'm going to be sharing my February favorites. I have a few things to share with you. Most of them are in the media department, so let's just get right on it. Let's start with fashion first because I feel like it's been a while where I had fashion items to share. And the first thing I want to share are these pair of boots. These are from Yes Style. They have a zipper on the inside, so it actually makes it really easy to slip on and off. And they're really comfortable, surprisingly. They do have laces in the front, but because of the zipper, it just makes it a lot easier. I don't have to really tie anything. I wanted to get these because um, I wanted to experiment with my fashion a little bit. I wasn't sure if I could actually pull off boots like these and I wanted something with an edgier look that I could throw on with my outfit and this has done the job. I love that it has more of a masculine look to it, but it still kind of has this feminine touch feminine silhouette. This actually makes me want to invest in some Doc Martens in the future because um, I think this is a very similar style to it. I also love that it has thicker sole, a thicker heel. I love that it just edges up any outfit. I've actually been pairing those boots with this leather jacket. I don't know if it's full leather because it's not as soft as I would expect it to be for like a full-on leather jacket but i thrifted this from goodwill that's why i don't know and i got this in the men's section it's a men's medium so it is large and oversized and baggy on me it kind of has like a letterman's jacket look and silhouette it has two large pockets a zipper these two have just been kind of my go-to items in february i've been pairing it mostly with something more girly more fitted underneath and then throw on this baggy jacket and these boots for some juxtaposition, some contrast. I even wore it with like a large oversized tee and it was super comfortable. Let's move on to makeup. I wanna talk about the Fenty Beauty Snap Shadows. This one is in number seven called Cadet. If you watched my last makeup tutorial, you would have seen this palette. I love these colors together. I especially love this yellow mustard shade. In general, I just really love their snap shadows because it's nice, it's compact. If you have two of these together, you can snap them together for traveling and it just makes it really easy to transport and convenient. Most of all, I just really love the packaging. I'm such a fan of Fenty, especially when it comes to their packaging. I love how just sleek this is and I have pretty small hands and it just fits really perfectly in my hands. It's super easy to use and I love that it comes with this giant mirror. You get a lot of visual space to do your makeup and look at yourself. If you didn't know already, I'm a huge Fenty girl, so love these. Next, I wanna talk about skincare. I have a new favorite cleanser to share with you. This is Holy Frog's Tosh Moo Water Lily Nourishing Milky Wash. My skin has been really dry, so I've been trying to hydrate inside by drinking more water and also hydrate the surface of my skin and this face wash has been really helpful with that it has a really nice milky texture to it just like in its name it's super gentle and it feels nourishing on my skin and i think it really helped to smoothen out my skin as well next i want to talk about a hair care product this is from nature elixir it's their daily drip hair oil and i use this in my hair when it feels really dry looks really dry and i need to add some shine back in some nourishment and this smells amazing. I can't really describe the smell to you because I don't know what it is. It just smells incredibly fresh. I just, I love it so much. And I actually use it probably every other day. I do like six to seven pumps, but I still have so much of it left. And I also love the packaging. I love its sleek design. I love the gold cap and the trim. And I just have to talk about packaging and branding because I love that stuff and it just looks so pretty on any vanity in any bathroom it is amazing next we are moving on to media favorites so i have a couple songs and a couple shows to share with you i've been watching a shit ton of tv shows so much so fun so good the first tv show i want to recommend to you is called high fidelity and it is on hulu this is the show that stars zoe kravitz i think she's super cool super edgy i love her style it's amazing and i had to watch it mostly because she was in it. She owns a record store and you go into her story when she's just broken up with her boyfriend and she's kind of thinking about all the great loves in her life, which there are five, and she tells the story of each of them and what happened, tries to figure out why it didn't work out with them. And I love her style on the TV show. It's like 
hipster casual-ish. It takes place in New York City, so that kind of frames a lot for you already, I think. I think I struggled a lot between loving her character and like thinking her character is just kind of a piece of shit. <laughs> um, but she is a very likable character. Um, I think for by the end of it, she definitely redeems herself. The next show I want to recommend is an Amazon TV show and it is Jack Ryan. Tom Clancy's Jack Ryan featuring John Krasinski. I've been really into crime mystery dramas, mostly fiction. Uh, <laughs> I, I just find them to be so enticing and interesting because I don't know where the story is going. Jack Ryan is a show about a CIA officer who is tracking down a criminal. <laughs> that pretty much sums it all up. It's a very exciting show. It has twists and turns and it had me on the edge of my seat. I definitely prefer season one over season two. I thought season one was way more exciting. The storytelling, the connections was just way more intricate and had more surprises to it. Highly, highly recommend it. It's really really good. Next, I want to talk about some songs that I really loved. The first one is called Mars by Alto Moon. But if gravity lets go and we float, we could see stars. This is just a really sweet, relaxing, and romantic song to play in the background, like before I sleep and also when I wake up. It's just really nice and soothing. And I'll read you a line from the lyrics so you can get a feel of like the vibe that it's going for. If gravity lets go and we float, we'll go see stars together. And if the earth stopped spinning and fell out of orbit, we'll live on Mars together. I thought it was so cute. The second song that I really loved a lot is called Potential by Alt Bloom. And this is also the song that I used in my last makeup tutorial. Yeah, we got potential, potential, come put your heart up. Both of these artists' names are kind of similar and they confuse me sometimes. I love this song. I think it's really fun and quirky and just kind of like um, flirty and just a good time. Like it has a really nice beat to it. Um, the lyrics are are cheeky and uh, it's cute. So check those out. Um, I will link them all down below along with everything else that I mentioned and talked about. I hope you enjoyed watching this video and learning what my favorites were. If you have favorites to share, please let me know down in the comments below. Don't forget to give it a like if you like this video and subscribe if you wanna see more videos from me and I will see you in my next video. Bye.